Hi and welcome back to a new instructional video. In this video, I'd like to tell you a little more about receive notifications when, for example, someone rings your Calyx video doorbell or when your motion sensor detects movement. It may happen that you no longer receive a notification on your Android smartphone. In most situations, this has one of the following causes. Your smart device is too far from your Wi-Fi router and therefore does not receive sufficient Wi-Fi signal. The notification settings for the Calyx Smart app on your Android smartphone are not correct. For more information about Wi-Fi, visit our website help.calyx.eu. In this video, I go into more detail about the notification settings on your Android smartphone, where to find them and what settings you need to check. Now I'm going to explain to you where to adjust the notification settings in your Calyx Smart app. Open your Calyx Smart app. Then choose the Me option at the bottom right of the screen. And then the Settings option at the top right. In this screen, go to the App Notification option. The settings in this screen allow you to control whether and how you want to receive notifications on your smartphone. Device Alert. Make sure this option is enabled so you can receive notification alerts in your message center. Do not disturb schedule. This option allows you to turn off notifications on set days and times. You can even create a separate schedule for this per smart device. System notification. This option ensures that messages are displayed in the notifications bar of your smartphone at the top of the screen. In addition to the settings within the Calyx Smart app, there are also settings in your smartphone that affect notifications from your smart devices. On your smartphone, go to Settings, and choose Apps. Then search for Calyx Smart and select it. The first setting we are going to check is for battery usage. Choose the option Battery. Make sure Allow Background Activity is enabled and that the Optimize Battery Usage option is disabled for the Calyx Smart app. Then go back one step and then choose Notifications and check there to make sure all notifications are enabled. If desired, you can still disable unwanted notifications here later. Then go back one step and then choose Permissions. Check here that all permissions such as camera, location, microphone, and storage are enabled. These required permissions depend in part on the type of smart devices you are using. For example, you need the camera permission to scan a QR code so you can add a smart video doorbell or smart video camera. Depending on the brand and type of smartphone and installed Android version, the names of the settings I showed you may differ. I hope with this video I was able to give you more clarity on how to check the notification settings and set them correctly. Hope to see you back at the next instructional video.